Hi, I'm Mighty MightyCZ37, and this is going to be a quick demonstration of how to do this room, which is one of the first sections of the, the game where you need to do a double bomb jump in order to collect an item. In fact, you have to do three double bomb jumps. Now, if you haven't gotten used to that, that can be a bit tricky. And I suggest you watch my other video on how dual bomb jumps work with some demonstrations of different timings that can work for it. But for this specific section, there's also another trick that you can use beyond just getting good at the timing. And that is that there are actually some decent visual indicators on each of these upward shafts that you can use in order to get your timing good enough that it should propel you up the full height. On this first section, you can see this thicker line alongside a little divot in the wall on the left side of this vertical shaft. And if you drop your second bomb around that area, you should be able to get a double bomb jump with enough height to get you up to the second level every time. And that looks like this. Another good tip is you're going to want to be holding left the entire time where you are in the air. Not beforehand, but while you're in the air. And that will help you get up onto the next level without having to worry about falling back down after you get your double bomb jump. For the second vertical shaft, there's a similar graphical indicator that you can use. There's this little section on the left side of the wall that comes out further towards the right than any other section on the left side. And if you drop a bomb anywhere between there this darker line up here, you should be able to get the double bomb jump. And that looks like this. As you can see, I dropped it right in the middle between those spots, and I was able to make it up. Then finally, we have the last vertical shaft, and this one doesn't have as great of a visual indicator but it's also the easiest one because you don't need as much height because all you have to do is touch the energy tank which you would normally see at the top of you. So, as long as you drop the bomb that is in mid-air somewhere in this section of the wall where it's going from a narrow part to a wide part, you should be able to get your double bomb jump and it's a pretty large range that you can do this in. And as long as you do it right, you should be able to get a double bomb jump like this. And that would collect your energy tank. And then you'd just be able to drop a single bomb down here, and then exit out, and head to Fendrana Drifts with your brand new energy tank. for watching and if there are any other tutorials that you would like me to make just uh, please make a comment on the video or send me a DM over discord thank you and have a nice day